Okay, so this is basically um, bench disassembly work of the uh, the Bosch pump. We'd be sure to um, lock the pump off with the, the lockout device there on the side of the pump before you remove it from the engine. And then proceeding to remove the control panel, the EDC unit, you require a T25 Torx driver and a T10 Torx driver. Okay. There are eight T25 screws located on the top of the EDC unit, which we will now remove. After removing the five T25 screws located in the top upper cast plate, you can remove the cast plate and place it on one side. Be sure to locate the gasket located here and make sure it is not lost. Then continue to remove the, fi the final remaining T25 screws. Okay. Now, before removing the EDC unit, Locate the cables feeding the spooling solenoid in the rear of the pump here. And the advanced solenoid located here. You will need to cut these staggered so that you can locate the cuts later for reconnection. Again, this is the feed for the rear fuel quantity spooling solenoid. And again, for the advanced and retired solenoid located in the underside of the pump. Again, staggered cuts. and then continuing to removal of the EDC after removing the eight T25s gently lift the control unit to expose the ribbon cable and at this point you'll need a T10 torque screwdriver to remove the pickup sensor and be very sure not to lose the screws inside the pump chassis And that is a complete removal of the pump EDC. Be sure to close the chassis up, make sure nothing can enter the chassis while it's opened up.